Why narcissists can only bow down when super empaths do this? For narcissists, remorse is foreign and concealed until the suffering has been overcome. They are incapable of offering sincere apologies based on personal accountability for negative outcomes. Accepting error or responsibility for their actions proves to be an insurmountable obstacle. Through cunning manipulation, narcissists impose their egocentric worldview on others, leaving in their aftermath a trail of emotional devastation. Motivated by their own profound insecurities, they go to great lengths to diminish your self-worth. When they cast aspersions on others, they unwittingly reveal their own character defects. Every deceitful action, every word spoken, and every perverted thought reflects inner turmoil. Seeking consolation, they endeavor to ensure that their companions share in their misery, intending to make you feel inferior in order to slate their insatiable desire for dominance. In spite of this turbulent dynamic, remember that two miserable people are not preferable to one. In the midst of sorrow, there is a desire for victory, indicating the potential for personal development and transformation. Rise above the pandemonium and escape the narcissist's grasp. The path to genuine fulfillment lies in reclaiming your power and recognizing your inherent value. In their emotional downfall, those lacking empathy frequently point the finger at others and allocate blame. Their inability to perceive the emotions of those around them renders them incapable of expressing genuine regret or sincere apologies. Engaging in a futile game of outsmarting or outmaneuvering a narcissist is futile, as victory over them is elusive. Consequently, I will impart today priceless advice on how to effectively sever connections with toxic narcissists, ensuring your safety and providing a respite from their pernicious influence. Before we embark on this enlightening journey, I would like to express my sincere appreciation for your time in viewing this video. Please share this invaluable information with your colleagues, family, and loved ones. And if you are new to our channel, I urge you to consider subscribing so that you can remain informed about our upcoming releases. Your unwavering support is a constant source of motivation, and I'm extremely grateful for it. Now, let's start. 1. The Intermittent Sanctuary in the presence of a narcissist, selecting solitude and withdrawal is the most prudent course of action. It is a waste of time and energy to engage in pointless conflict with these individuals. What's the reason? The mission of overcoming their poisonous influence remains insurmountable. Therefore, do yourself a tremendous favor and avoid getting involved with them in the endless cycle of conflicts, confrontations, and ego battles. Permit them to revel in their illusory victory, as their very essence flourishes on such deceptions. Instead, prioritize your health and protect your vital energy by removing yourself from their pernicious web. You become the ultimate victor by doing so, both in the immediate present and the distant future. Ignore the advice of negative individuals such as the narcissist and their toxic entourage. Select the refuge of self-preservation. Two. Super empaths will show the power of personal development. Abandon ineffective attempts to convince or coerce the narcissist to change. Instead, embrace the transformative journey of self-improvement and turn your attention inward. Expanding your social circle and cultivating non-toxic relationships becomes crucial. Excessive reliance on others can be dangerous if underlying codependency is not addressed. Therefore, focus your energy on areas within your control, such as refining your self-perception, living in the present, and nurturing personal development. Remember that genuine transformation stems from an authentic desire for change. If the narcissist in question genuinely desired to progress, they would have already made significant efforts to alter their behavior. Therefore, reclaim control of your life and devote yourself to personal development in every way possible. The narcissist is irrelevant to this endeavor. Only through your actions and decisions can you bring about profound changes in your existence. Accept this opportunity with enthusiasm. You must free yourself from the narcissist's influence. Embrace the full extent of life's potential and forge onward as the best manifestation of your being. 
by prioritizing personal development and abandoning narcissists, you pave the way for a life filled with fulfillment and purpose. Free. Knowing that the narcissist is deaf, super empaths must articulate their needs with acuity. Attempting to communicate your requirements to a narcissist will only foster conflict. Their self-centeredness erects an impenetrable barrier that renders your thoughts, emotions, and desires irrelevant. Accepting this severe reality may be difficult, but it is necessary. Inwardly cultivate self-care, cultivating your well-being in authentic and profound ways. Expecting a narcissist to fulfill your needs is a fruitless endeavor. It is unsustainable to rely solely on others to fulfill your requirements. You must take responsibility for your own fulfillment. Recognize that the narcissist plays no pivotal role in your development and reconnect with the genuineness of your being. With this newfound clarity, you can anticipate harmonious relationships with compassionate and supportive individuals. Freed from the shackles of toxic relationships, you forge ahead, forming adult relationships based on mutual respect and sincere care. You have labored assiduously to achieve this success, and the nurturing relationships you deserve are now ready to be embraced. 4. Unleash the Self-Defense Mastery A mastery of emotional self-control and spiritual self-discipline is essential to protect oneself from narcissists' malevolent projections. You have the ability to prevent these individuals from manipulating your emotions for their sick amusement. If you wish to counter narcissistic forces with decorum and honor, it is imperative that you prioritize your own well-being. Integrating self-care practices and cultivating positive habits into one's daily life yields transformative benefits that can leave one feeling revitalized and empowered. It is only natural to feel overwhelmed when confronted by the narcissist's polished exterior and impeccable charisma, especially if putting oneself first is not a habit. Regaining a sense of self-worth can feel like an uphill battle when we've carried the weight of culpability for too long. However, as you awaken each morning, keep in mind that the reins of fate are now securely in your hands. This responsibility rests solely on your own capable shoulders as your health and safety takes precedence over attending to the requirements of others. Number 5. Protecting their compassion Sympathy for narcissists is similar to pursuing a mirage. It is a futile endeavor. Those with naive positive opinions of these individuals are frequently caught in their web of deceit and manipulation. The severe reality is that narcissists lack empathy, leaving you feeling deceived, powerless, and despondent. Even empathetic individuals can be profoundly affected by the negative energy and emotions emanating from their narcissistic counterparts, despite not resonating on the same emotional frequency. It is essential for empathetic individuals to protect themselves from the emotionally exhausting effects of such encounters. Despite the necessity of extending fundamental courtesy to the narcissist, maintaining a safe distance becomes essential. Your compassion is a valuable resource that should be reserved for those who truly merit it. 6. Forging Bonds of Trust To navigate the path to recovery with poise and dignity, Escaping the clutches of a narcissist requires the presence of a trustworthy and dependable support network. It is imperative that you give yourself ample time to recover from the injuries you've sustained, and it is your responsibility to use this time for extensive self-care. Seek out individuals in whom you have complete faith and who are able to provide both compassionate listening and insightful advice. Having someone knowledgeable and supportive to confide in is of utmost importance, regardless of whether that person is an expert on the topic or a trusted confidant among friends, family, or mentors. Nonetheless, it is essential to approach these connections with a balanced mindset, avoiding the temptation to use them as emotional trash cans. In times of need, they become the havens where we find solace, understanding, and genuine worth. You can't rehabilitate for narcissistic abuse on your own. A strong support system is essential to your recovery. Finding individuals who provide empathetic comprehension and unwavering support is essential for relieving our burdens. By cultivating a community that provides emotional support, 
We reduce the likelihood of seeking validation and solace from unreliable sources who, if their true intentions are revealed, may cause further damage. You ultimately bear the primary responsibility for your physical and emotional health, placing the uttermost importance on self-care practices that foster personal development and growth. Developing and maintaining a solid support network over time becomes an essential element of attaining this fundamental goal. We appreciate your unwavering support.